Hey guys, Rebecca from Element. So I just wanted to come on and do a demo of my um, rose and lavender uh, clamshell stuffed with um, truffle. Now, unlike bath bombs, um, some of my bath bombs that float and spin and all that, um, these are quite heavy. So these are more of like a luxurious um, spa soak. So they're not going to... Um, float. Because these are, there is the bath fizzy, as you can see. You can see the bath fizzy, but you can see the butters on the top already. Um, but uh, yeah, it's not going to float and all that. It smells absolutely amazing. So I just wanted to show for um, all the people. I have actually sold so many of these uh, just for Easter. But I wanted to show that just in, I don't want anyone expecting a um, you know huge display of spinning and colors and all that. Now it does turn. You can't see it very well, but it does turn the water um, pink. But um, just a faint pink, but um, the uh, as you can see, it's still going, and the bath truffle inside is still. Um, but these are like a really relaxing um, bath soap, and the uh, truffle here, it's the same thing. See. My truffles uh, sink because they are they're heavy in butters, so they're not going to spin. The uh, rose and lavender clamshell still going, and the um, truffle. That's just one truffle, and when you use those truffles, they sell in sets of three. They um, you only need one, um, even half of one actually, because as you can see from the top of the water, um, very high in butters. I wish you could see the water is a, a really pretty pink, but um, I don't even like actually calling these bath bombs because when people think of bath bombs, they think of the floating spinning. These are more of like a luxurious um, spa-like uh, fizzy melt. And it has the lavender and rose botanicals. And they create this um, this bubble spa sound too. Truffle on the inside, and there's still some of the clam left. As you can see, they're not, um, you know, like I said, a high fizz. Uh, they're more of just a dissolve. Um, the clamshell recipe I use is actually um, pretty basic. It's essential oils, uh, citric acid, baking soda, um, fine uh, Epsom salts. Um, pink Himalayan, um, you know, they're really hard. That's why if I was to make this recipe into a bath bomb, it would just absolutely sink in like a hard rock. So 
So there we go. I should have stopped there because um, there's still it's still going as you can see. Um, you know, these are actually, you could even, if you wanted to, I actually will, uh, before it completely fizzes away, um, I will, because it's like a salt scrub, I will scrub my body and my legs while I'm in the bath with it, and it's like an exfoliator as well. Um, so that's another thing you can do with it. But, um, all right, ladies, I should talk to you later.